The Long Arm is a new scout rifle added to Destiny 2 as part of Season of the Seraph. This one is related to Dead Man's Tale, albeit in a legendary version, coming out the weapon foundry Tex Mechanica. It's currently one of the most popular weapons in the game right now. Well, today I'm going to have a look at the stats, the perks, and the goggles to chase for PvE and PvP, plus also have a look at how to get Long Arm in Destiny 2. Well, if you're new around here or find this useful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. And roughly 98% of viewers who watch this week in video games aren't subscribed, so subscribe today and never miss an update. Well, let's dive right into that crucial information how to get Long Arm in Destiny 2. Well, to get Long Arm, you have to go through the new dungeon, and that is Spire of the Watcher. That can be found on Savathun's Throne World next to the Enclave. We can get long arm as a random drop from the first encounter, which is where you have to scale the tower itself. I do believe this is the only place you can get this weapon, although once you get in your loot pool, you can also get it from the secret chests found in the dungeon. Now, while the second and the third encounter need if you be able to get this done in a timely manner, you can easily go in and farm the first encounter over and over again. Plus, it's a good way to learn the mechanics of the dungeon. So if you want to farm to get a good long arm, then it is quite easy. Well, next up, let's have a closer look at Long Arm in Destiny 2. So, Long Arm is a legendary energy scout rifle with an aggressive frame, meaning it's got high damage and high recoil. And looking at the stats, you've got 100 for impact, 55 for range, 25 for stability, 53 for handling, 45 for reload speed, 14 for airborne effectiveness. It's a 120 rounds per minute scout rifle with 15 in the magazine. Well, the new Tex Mechanica weapons come with the Origin trait Tex Balance Stock. This is where damaging targets while firing from the hip increases handling, reload speed, and movement speed while you are aiming down sights. Well, next up, let's have a look at the Long Arm God Roll Guide. So the Long Arm Scout Rifle comes with some really, really nice perks, including a Rapid Hit, Wellspring, Dragonfly, Explosive Payload, Subsistence, Opening Shot, just to name a few. This essentially is a mini DMT, so if you like Scout Rifles, I think you're going to really like Long Arm and find a set of perk combinations that work for you. Well, for PvE, corkscrew rifling, tactical mag, subsistence, and explosive payload would be good. So corkscrew rifling slightly increases range stability and slightly increases handling speed. Tactical mag slightly increases stability, increases reload speed, and slightly increases magazine size. Then you've got subsistence, so defeating targets partially reloads the magazine from reserves. And explosive payload, this is very good for PvE content. Projectiles create an air of effect detonation on impact. Then for PvP, Arrowhead Break, Accurize Rounds, Rapid Hit and Opening Shot would be good. So Arrowhead Break greatly controls the recoil and increases the handling speed. Accurize Rounds increases range. Rapid Hit, so Rapid Precision Hits temporarily increases the stability and the reload speed. Then you've got Opening Shot, so improved accuracy and range on the opening shot of the attack. Well, let me know in the comments what you think of Long Arm and let me know your favourite roles. And that is it for this guide for how to get the Long Arm in Destiny 2. And as always, thank you so much for watching or listening. For more Destiny 2 content like this, hit that subscribe button down below and subscribe to This Week in Video Games. Or you can check me out on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Well, thanks again. I'll see you soon.